Uncle Nicholas Brown. It's Uncle Sam. Nazim is busy picking a T-shirt or something for next week, so... <laughs> you let me host my own game show. Welcome to Uncle Sam's Quizlam! <laughs> now, to play the game, we've got an audience member. Come on up! <laughs> OK, uh, what is your name? My name's Jai. Well, Jai, do you like uh, quiz shows? Sure, I love them. You love quiz shows. What is yeah. your favourite Muslim quiz show? Oh, Muslim quiz show. <laughs> Just the uh, top three, whatever that will do. <laughs> oh, Slumdog Millionaire. <laughs> that's a, not a, that's a, uh, that's a movie. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Are you guys ready to play the game? <laughs> All right. Okay, here we go. First question. Man's best friend. A very loyal creature, great sense of smell, likes to fetch the stick. Dog. You think, you think it is dog, is it? <laughs> Incorrect. It's actually my cousin Faisal. <laughs> He's my best friend. Very good with fetching the stick. Zero points to you. OK, next one. You can use it to find the answer to anything. Very quick and simple. Uh, it is known as the information superhighway. If you have any questions, you can search and you will find the answer in seconds. What is it? It's got to be Google. What? Google. <laughs> no, show the answer. The Quran. <laughs> the holy book of Islam, obviously. What a stupid. Come on, Jai. Are you okay? Is it okay? Yeah. Uh, we did an IQ test before we, s <laughs> we chose the contestants. Okay. This one, very simple one. A highly esteemed place where medical professionals and doctors and surgeons work tirelessly 24 hours a day. What is it called? A hospital. No, incorrect. It's a taxi. <laughs> there are also lawyers work there, politicians, scientists, accountants, all work in taxi. Stupid. <laughs> um, okay, this one. Oh, the Muslims. Where are the Muslims? Make some noise. <laughs> yes. Okay, they will know this answer, but it might be tricky for you. Where is the first place Muslims must visit when they come to Australia? Very popular place for tourists. You bump into all of your friends there. No visit to Australia is complete without checking out this place first. What is it? Oh. Donald. Uh, any, anybody else? Uh, no, no. Bondi? Not Centrelink. What's an, uh, Bondi, you think? Bondi is your answer. Yeah. At the beach, is it? Yeah. Okay, let's... Obviously wrong. It is the uh, customs interrogation room. <laughs> It's good! All of your friends are there. Beautiful facilities. Good, they look after you. Four or five days in a row for free. Love it. Okay, this one. Try to, try to visualize it. Uh, this is something that tells you whether you can go or not. If it is down, you can't go. If it is up, you can go. Down, you can't go. Up, you can go, but be careful because it can come down at any moment and destroy the car. Okay, what is it? It's like the, the parking. What? Where you put your parking ticket in? No. That's stupid. No, incorrect. <laughs> it is my wife. <laughs> I call her the boom gate. She's always doing this. Sometimes she'll do this as well, but... <laughs> That's the end of the quiz. Let's tally up your score. You got zero correct. <laughs> well done to Jai. Well done. And Jai, before you go... Uh, all of our contestants today on Uncle Sam's Quizland go home with a brand new laptop computer, stereo surround system, and combined washer dryer. Give it up! Okay. What? Oh, oh, okay. Uh, uh, sorry, I'm uh, only contestants who score at least one point. Uh, <laughs> receive the gift pack, but uh, you don't get anything. But that's it. You can take a seat. Take a seat. Give it up.